हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सिंप्लीफाइड बायोलॉजी टुडेज टॉपिक इज गोल्जी कॉम्प्लेक्स गोल्जी कॉम्प्लेक्स इज ऑल्सो रेफर्ड एज गोल्जी अपैरेटर्स और गोल्जी बॉडीज इन प्लांट्स इट इज नोन एज डिक्टियोसोम्स गोल्जी कॉम्प्लेक्स वॉज डिस्कवर्ड बाय कैमिलो गोल्जी फ्रॉम द नर्व सेल्स ऑफ बॉन आउल they are present in all eukaryotic cells except seed tubes of plants sperms of pteridophytes and gymnosperms and rbc of mammals cells that are rich in golgi bodies are nerve cells glandular cells salivary glands root cap cells and dividing cells golgi complex occurs between the nucleus just outer to the endoplasmic reticulum and the cell membrane structure of golgi complex was given by dalton and felix it consists of cisternae tubules vesicles and vacuoles cisternae are membranous sacs these are the membranous sacs enclosing a lumen or a cavity that is about 60 to 90 angstrom in diameter the number of cisternae in plants is 3 to 8 while in animals it is 10 to 20 tubules form a network and are interconnected with the cisternae they are present towards the periphery of the cisternae and you can say they are formed by the breakdown of cisternae vesicles are small sac like structures about 20 to 80 nanometer in diameter while vacuoles are formed from the expanded ends of the cisternae the expanded ends of cisternae break down to form the vacuoles golgi complex has two phases cis phase and the trans phase cis phase is the forming phase when new cisternae are formed by the fusion of vesicles produced by the endoplasmic reticulum so the convex side of the golgi complex is the cis phase where vesicles produced by the endoplasmic reticulum fuse with the cisternae of the golgi complex trans phase is the maturing phase where older cisternae are broken down to form tubules and vesicles now the concave side of the golgi complex is the trans phase where the cisternae breaks up to form tubules vesicles and vacuoles in fungi the dictyosomes are unicisternal means they are consists of only single cisternae functions of golgi complex it processes packages and secretes material the best way to remember the function is it is actually the cells post office proteins and lipids formed by the smooth endoplasmic reticulum and the rough endoplasmic reticulum are released as vesicles these vesicles they fuse with the cisternae to form the golgi complex inside the golgi complex these proteins and lipids get modified packaged and are then released as vesicles the vesicles produced have secretory products now these secretory vesicles has products that can be used within the cell and outside the cell so the main function of golgi complex is packaging of substances and cellular secretion the secretions of golgi complex are like sweat tear saliva mucilage yolk pigments like melanin collagen hormones like insulin thyroxin 
glycosylation occurs inside the Golgi complex. Glycosylation is addition of glucose by the help of glycosyl transferase enzyme to form glycolipids, glycoproteins, polysaccharides. Pectic compounds are formed, hemicellulose, mucopolysaccharides, hyaluronic acid, all these are formed inside the Golgi complex, even the matrix of connective tissue. It also helps in transport of lipids absorbed by the smallest intestine. Next function is membrane flow, means help, it helps in transporting substances outside the cell. Now as it transports substances outside the cell, it causes renewal of the cell membrane. Cell membrane components formed by the endoplasmic reticulum, they are released as vesicles which then fuse with the cisternae where they get modified. They are then released by the Golgi cisternae as vesicles. They move to the cell membrane and by the process of exocytosis, the substances are released outside the cell. Now, as the substances are released outside the cell, the membrane of the vesicle fuses with the cell membrane causing its renewal. Next function, it helps in regulating fluid balance of the cell by producing contractile vacuoles that are osmoregulatory. Next, formation of lysosomes. Now the digestive enzymes released as vesicles in by the cisternae act as lysosomes. Next is formation of acrosome. Acrosome has the digestive enzymes. It is present in the sperm head. It helps in the penetration of the sperm into the egg during fertilization. So the digestive enzymes present in the acrosome helps in the penetration of the sperm into the egg during fertilization. So these acrosomes are also formed by the Golgi bodies. And last, cell plate formation. During cytokinesis in plants, vesicles are released by the Golgi complex. They contain cellulose and pectin. These vesicles arrange on the equatorial plate and fuse to form the cell wall, dividing the cell into two daughter cells. So that's all with the functions of Golgi complex. Thank you. Thank you for watching.